Now, in Blaugrana's colours, Barca fans and football neutrals are starting to wonder, will this teenage sensation live up to the expectations of the big leagues? Or is this another washed dream in near sight? Well, sit back and relax as we dive into why Vitor Roque is Barcelona's next superstar. Born on the 25th of February, 2005, in the municipality city of Timoteo, Brazil, Vitor Hugo Roque Ferreira began his football journey at La Academia de América Mineiro at the age of 10 before finally getting his big break at Cruzeiro in 2019, where he made his professional debut at the age of 16. His meteoric rise continued at Atlético Paranaense, where he showcased his talent on the grand stages of Brazilian top-tier football in the Serie A and Copa Libertadores. With his lightning-quick pace, dazzling footwork and silky smooth touch, the Brazilian wonderkid comfortably weaves his magic past defenders before unleashing thunderous strikes from unexpected angles. His ambidexterity makes him even more unpredictable on the ball, constantly giving the defense nightmares on how to shut him down. Legend has it that they are still looking for El Tigrinho's remedy. Roque's rise wasn't just sprinkled with mere potential. It started with trophies, records and accolades right from a young age. He wasn't just another Brazilian teenager living off his freestyle and futsal skills. He demanded victory every time he stepped on the pitch. He led his team to two youth championships, both at America Mineiro and Cruzeiro, showing off his leadership and clutch performances at such a young age. For Cruzeiro's under-17 team, Roque contributed a staggering 39 goals in 34 appearances, making a name for himself as one of the brightest young forwards in the game. The 2021 Best Player Award at the Under-17 Campeonato Brasileiro saw Roque cement his status as Brazil's next big star. At just 16 years and 9 months old, Roque became the youngest player ever to score for the Cruzeiro senior team after scoring the team's opener in the 2-2 draw to Vila Nova in a domestic cup game. Four days later, Vita found the back of the net twice in the 5-0 away win over Sergipe to mark his debut at the Copa do Brasil tournament, making him the youngest player ever to bag a brace in the competition. With just six goals and an assist in 11 senior appearances, Vitor Roque's talent made waves through Brazil's top-tier leagues, and a switch was imminent. A $4 million move to Atlético Paranaense in Brazil's Serie A saw Vitor Roque become the biggest transfer in the club's history at just 16. Ten more goal contributions saw Roque help his new club secure qualification for the Copa Libertadores with a sixth-place finish at the end of the season. 2023 was the year Vita Roque really took things to a whole new level. The South American Under-20 Championship, hosted by Colombia, saw the very best talents across the continent feature in one of the most exciting youth tournaments you can ever ask for. The star of the tournament was Vitor Roque, who finished on top of the goal-scoring chart with six goals in eight appearances to lead Brazil to their 12th title in the competition's history. A few months later, Vitor Roque was rewarded with a call-up to the Brazilian national team and made his cameo debut in the 1-0 friendly defeat to Morocco. 45 goal contributions in 45 games in his second full season in Brazil's Serie A division saw El Tigrinho fully unleash himself on the grand stages. Unfortunately for the Paranaense faithful, the love story with their teenage boy was near its end, as interest from Europe's big leagues grew stronger after every five-star performance. Despite interest from financial powerhouses like Bayern Munich, Chelsea and Paris Saint-Germain, the Catalan Giants won the race for the teenage sensation in the 2023 summer transfer window for a whopping 30 million euros fee, making it the biggest transfer in the history of Brazilian football. With a seven-year contract and the 500 million euro release clause in the agreement, Vitor is an untouchable asset in Barcelona's future and a significant investment for a young talent that many believe will pay off handsomely. This isn't your average signing, folks. This is a game-changer for the footballing powerhouse and a blazing comet of talent igniting hope and dreams in every Blaugrana heart. Remember Ronaldinho's samba magic? Messi's darting runs? Roque brings that spark back, that raw, electrifying feeling of something special. These early achievements at such a young age were not just impressive, they were historic. Roque isn't just good, he is rewriting the record books, a sign of things to come for the young prodigy. Roque's impact transcends stats and accolades. He paints magic with every touch, 
weaving a tapestry of skill that leaves fans breathless. Let's dive deeper into what makes Vitor Roque so special. Like a gazelle gliding across the savanna, effortlessly evading predators, Roque's dribbling style is so quick, agile, and unpredictable. His close control allows him to dance through congested spaces, leaving defenders grasping at his shadow. He utilizes a variety of skills, like stepovers, roulette turns, and sudden bursts of acceleration to skip past his defenders. Aside from spotting goal-scoring opportunities, another key attribute in his arsenal is his playmaking. He possesses a radar-like ability to pick out teammates with inch-perfect and defense-splitting passes like a hot knife through butter. Roque can literally create goal-scoring chances seemingly out of thin air. To add the cherry on top of the cake, Vita Roque is an outright clinical finisher. Whether it is a powerful drive from outside the box, a delicate chip over the goalkeeper, or a composed finish in a tight angle, every touch near the goal reeks of danger and the potential for a moment of magic. Vitor's ambidexterity is another key trait that highlights why the Brazilian literally has no weakness, making him unpredictable and constantly unleashing unexpected shots or passes that keep the defenders on their toes at all times. Roque's technical skills aren't just impressive, they're mesmerizing. He's not just any player, he's an artist, an entertainer, and a maestro with the ball at his feet. And this is just the beginning of his story. Comparisons are inevitable, especially when we witness a young talent as electrifying as Vitor Roque. So, how does the youngster stack up against fellow Brazilian superstars who burst onto the scene at a young age? Like the legend Ronaldo Nazario, Roque exploded onto the scene very early and made his professional debut at age 16. They share a similar physical build, combining blistering pace, power, and an impressive finishing ability. Both possess natural goal-scoring instincts and a hunger for victory, a trait that made R9 a World Cup winner and Ballon d'Or award winner. Even though Roque isn't quite as flashy as the likes of Neymar and Ronaldinho, they all share a flair for the spectacular thanks to an array of skills and ball manipulation. Their dribbling skills and ability to create something out of nothing are always a joy to watch. However, Roque seems more focused on directness and efficiency in front of the goal compared to Neymar's flair for showmanship. While drawing comparisons is natural, it's crucial to remember Roque is forging his own path. He possesses elements of some of the great legends, but his raw power and clinical finishing might lean closer to Ronaldo Nazario, while his technical wizardry and vision echo Neymar's brilliance. On the other hand, Barcelona's philosophy is more than just tactics. It's a love symphony sung on the pitch, one built on possession, relentless attacks, and an unwavering belief in technical mastery. This tiki-taka style demands players who think quickly and thrive in tight spaces to weave intricate passing patterns that break down defenses. Imagine a team that never loses control, patiently circulating the ball, drawing opponents out of position before launching incisive attacks through precise passing and lightning movement. That's the essence of Barcelona's game. Technical prowess is paramount. Players need silky touches, sharp vision, and composure to keep the ball moving like a well-oiled machine. It's not just about individual skills, it's about understanding the rhythm of the game, knowing when to keep possession and when to unleash his attacking prowess. Roque seems to grasp this philosophy naturally, making his move to Barca almost preordained. Imagine Roque linking up with Pedri and Gundogan in midfield, their quick thinking and fluid passing creating a whirlwind of attacking options. Picture him darting past defenders on the wing, creating space for Lewandowski to unleash his lethal finishing. The possibilities are endless, a vibrant canvas where Roque's talent can truly blossom. The past might have been bumpy, but Roque is the shot of adrenaline Barca desperately needs to get back to where they belong. He's the symbol of a new era, a return of the long-lost attacking flair, and a future where goals rain down and opponents tremble. It's more than just scoring, it's about joy, creativity, and reclaiming that Barca magic. Since he arrived in Barcelona in January 2024, the 19-year-old has had the city of Barcelona chanting his name. After making his La Liga debut as a late-game substitute in the 2-1 win against Las Palmas, Vitor opened his goal-scoring account for Barcelona in the 1-0 win over Osasuna, coolly heading home, the game winner in less than a minute after coming into the game. Another impressive cameo saw Roque score his second goal for the club with a well-placed left-footed finish 
in the 3-1 road win against Alaves. However, a double yellow card saw Vitas cut short after spending 13 minutes on the pitch. Experts have lauded the young Brazilian's game, highlighting his potential as a perfect fit for the club's playing style. Renowned Spanish journalist Guillem Balag called him a player with phenomenal potential. Barcelona manager Xavi Hernandez also added, he's the future of our attack. His intelligence and ability to thrive in tight spaces are incredible. Statistical models predict a bright future, suggesting he could reach similar goal-scoring heights as Uruguayan legend Luis Suarez in his prime years at Barcelona. Ballon d'Or aspirations might seem distant, but his age and potential put him in the conversation in the long run, especially if he flourishes at Barca. Will he become another failed Lionel Messi reincarnate, or the messiah the Blaugrana has desperately yearned for? Only time will tell. But one thing is for sure, Vitor Roque's story is just beginning, and it's going to be legendary.